destroying people who do that. I expect um, a lot of the neutral are going to be um, be either forcing her way in with like a dash tag or like a jump forward aerial, right. or she's gonna shield and na uh, narrow shield a lot. That's gonna be the neutral, because mm -hmm. that's kind of how the old school sheiks would play this matchup. They don't use platforms a lot, right? Which, which is definitely more new school, and tries to get games. That's a big deal too. It's true, and it's pretty much two quick stocks right there. Exactly right. Like he just has the, the he has the exploitable defensive habits that B is definitely exploiting, as you can tell by the stock difference. Right. Just double spot dodge, but actually wins out at that time. But she read it. I think it was an execution error on her part. Yeah. So you see what I mean? Like situations like that. Mm -hmm. Interesting there. I probably would have went for a shine, but. Both worked a, out I'm, really well. I'm waiting for the narrow shields to be coming out. Also, uh, expect a lot of shield the laser and then jump sh just short hop in like fair. Right. That's wow. a pretty standard uh, chic thing to do, especially when you don't have power shields unlocked. Nice there. I'm surprised it didn't shield poke, honestly. <laughs> yeah. N uh, chic there. a lot of. Looks like Ellie's doing better and better though. Nice. I mean, he just took three stocks uncontested. So. Yeah, that was insane. Sixty-five percent for three stocks. Momentum is definitely in his court right now, and you can tell because B's kind of a little panicking. Yeah, he just throws out a lot of down smashes when he starts panicking. I actually was like super unprepared for that. I knew he was gonna throw out some nervous options, but I didn't expect like three down smashes. You didn't expect the nervous option to be an offensive option. Yeah, to be a, like a down smash. You thought it was gonna around. be more of a roll or spot dodge. Yeah, that's what I was getting ready for, so I just can't get hit by it. That makes sense. That's it. Oh. Nice. He could have been. He should have went for the next. Uh, the other next. Uh, oh day. wow! He kind of just chokes it, eh? Yeah. That was definitely a choker, you know. Uh, so he's probably gonna go to FD and like. Oh yeah. Oh no, he's going back. It's probably like Sheik's favorite stage too. I know Elliot really likes Battlefield. Oh yeah, I love Battlefield. He loves Battlefield. We'll always go to it. Yeah. Which is which surprised me. But I actually actually no, I I kind of agree though. Yeah. I think Sheik on Battlefield versus Fox is really good, but against Falco it's all right. Right. Because it, it's a really good stage for Falco. Like a really really good one. Nice, just grab ledge now. Actually, those those lasers are pretty good. Just got three percent. Yeah. Bam, down smash. Yep. See what I mean? He is a spot dodger for sure. Like um, Elliot Falco. Yeah. For he sure. spot dodges as a nervous reaction a lot of the time. Nice grab. I like that. Oh man, high Darren shield. Nice read though. Spot dodge shine again. Just has to oh. wait for it. Fairs from ledge are so oppressive from Sheik. Actually, they're yeah. good. They're good retaliation because it it forces you to respect her distance, right? True. Like if you're getting fair from ledge, you're like, okay, I guess I have to back up now. Nice fair. Grab ledge, and that's a free edge guard. Yeah, Wall of Bears is really, really good when Falco's on platform. Falco is actually not that good on platform when Sheik has center stage. That's true, that's true. It's a lot better for Falco to play the ground, grounded game because he has better anti-airs and he has better ground control with lasers. Yeah. Like, contesting with the platforms is not, I think, good at all for Falco in the neutral unless it's to extend the combo, but then you're not in the neutral anymore, right? Yeah, I agree. So I think he should always be on the ground. Like I, I don't really see a situation to be ever be on the platform other than to like maybe Isaiah drop laser like when the yeah. Sheik is camping. Same kind of applies for Fox too, right? Fox doesn't really have much on the platform. Platform game on this? Yeah, I, yeah. I agree. Species are very, very similar. Nice there. Oh, I should have up tilted, I think. I think so too. If he was going to read that they were going to not tech, then up tilt would have been the, the choice Yeah, that's there. easy. 
If you have another stock, that's easy. I mean, you can always just, like, trade. Yeah, having a stock advantage always is so good. All right, name changing. Looks like you're going uh, FT. Yeah, I can see that. I think once LA realized, like, oh, going to Battlefield didn't do anything, mm -hmm. might as well go to the stan standard, you know? Nice double shine. Nice Nair to punish the tournament winner. He's just being oppressive. Oh, but messes up his one tech skill like shield pressure sequence that gets shield grabbed in the middle of it. Nice read. Just goes for the edge. That was be careful very, very risky sides, up here. On both sides. Get up shine. Oh, has the read, but misspaced. Nice power shield there. I like that. Bear out of shield. Really good out of shield option there. Super good. Oh, man. Nice up tilt. Ooh, that up air to shark there on reaction to the yeah. Falcon's full hop was so good. It's risky though. If he, if he uh, did an up tilt there, that was so sick. Oh, that read. Oh, downer. I'm surprised the dash tag didn't reach, but hey, down smash right after the, to cover the double jump. Nice lasers. That was so good. Grab ledge. Uh, yeah, nothing you can really do there, honestly. I think he had enough time to grab ledge, but it's he was so close to the ledge that it was like, obviously he just didn't trust his wave dash. Right. Oh, nice. Catches the jump with the laser. Nice oppressive lasers in the corner. Nice shot enter, grab ledge, and that's free. Oh no. Well, <laughs> makes it work somehow. Makes it work. Yeah. Yeah, that's one of the properties of meteors or of uh not meteors, uh, spikes, is if the opponent's airborne and they're not in knockdown percent, then they get reset back to neutral. Yeah. So they true. can grab you out of you hitting them, essentially. So that's a big, big deal. He needs to throw out maybe some like up tilts. Oh man, that shield grab was so close. Oh, she's kind of panicking a little bit. Like right near dash Yeah, tag. there. I would have just like put him in the corner and just put an up tilt for the dash tag. Mm -hmm, right? Honestly. Just space bears up tilt. You know, play yeah. the West Balls game. Sheik's approach options. Hitbox wise are really bad. Dash tag actually does not cover her face. Oh really? It's not disjointed at all. It's actually yeah. the opposite of disjointed. And beats grab uh, too. Like I'm telling, like in the Oh yeah, yeah, it beats corner, grab. Yeah. And like the only thing that you it wouldn't it wouldn't be is like Shroha Bear, but she has no forward momentum, like in her drift. So like it's re reactable if you see her jump or not. Right? Yeah. So I want to. See, I don't understand why he's not really doing too much of the kind of lame stuff, as they say. Yeah, it's hard though. Like people say, Elliot's lame because he's like he's lame in person and in game. Mm -hmm. But like he's not actually that lame. He just kind of does a lot of tech skill stuff and like oppresses you with like he he almost plays kind of ginger, mango esque. Ginger. Oh, okay. He's like pretty ginger. I can see it. Mm -hmm. Um. But for some, yeah, he just doesn't play like super lame. Against Sheik, he should definitely like not be so impatient. He's jumping the gun. Yeah. Just yeah, relax. Yeah. Laser yeah. a bit, you know, dash dance a bit. You don't always have to force a situation. Like right there with that dare. Like that was a level one dare, right? He yeah. could have just ran to the left maybe and just fall down with the laser. I agree. He's not using a lot of utility, I should say. I think he doesn't realize it because like once he does get the punish, he gets so much off it though. So he's yeah. not really considering it. That's the weird thing about Shine. Sometimes they get sent really far away. Yeah. Like, it looks like they got pushed off by the momentum or something. 
would have liked to shine grab there. Yep. Oh, that's risky. Uh, it was a little greedy. Nice. See, now that's the shine grab. Maybe he was just waiting for the adaptation. Gets hit out of his up B or his jump. Yep. Bears? Just bear. Just keep bearing. Oh, man. See what I mean? Like, he keeps approaching yeah. like where Falco is slower, therefore more reactable, right? Just, you know, put up a wall. Like, you can be aggressive, but not in the sense of, like, you have to, like, go all in one motion. You kind of want to encroach. Right. Like, move up, kind of be, like, a very nomadic play style, right? Yeah. Where you move to a place, you make it your home a bit, move to the next spot, make it your home. It's kind of more like one swift motion where he just kind of throws everything off the table. Yeah, it's really costing him here, I think. But, like, yeah, it's... He just gets those like once in a while and just like gets so much off it though. Yeah, he definitely has the punish game on lock. I've yeah, seen that his, was bad. I've Sorry. seen his training regimen and uh, he has like a two hour solo practice where like a lot of it is just tech skill and punishing characters. Oh, okay. Like, he's a grinder for sure, a tech skill. That's, that's weird. Really? He spends two hours a day? Yeah. Wow. Just, uh, just tech skill. Wow, and then crazy. he net plays for like six more hours. What kind of stuff does he practice? Like, he likes to just cut zero to death characters for like five minutes. Uh -huh. um, making sure that he can shine grab, wave dash, up B, shortens. Okay. All to the whole, the whole shebang, right? Okay. Because in this day and age, you gotta have everything unlocked. Man, I'm gonna sound like I'm talking shit, but I feel like Kobe's a lot better though, still. I feel like Kobe recently, sick. yeah. He's so much better. All right, let's see how Elliot, see what I mean? Elliot yeah. just kind of keeps pushing buttons, pushing buttons, pushing buttons, moving forward. Never changing up his tempo by moving back just a bit. <laughs> Taking like a, like a quarter, quarter second break, you know? I agree. That's just whole ledge, yeah. I mean, he has a chance to take this first game. It's kind of like when like in piano or in music, like sheet music, they just don't have breaks. Yeah, like right here, up tilt. Oh, see? I think he's gonna dash attack there. Like, every laser has been for approaching. He's never, like, lasered in. And that was actually pretty good. Yeah, but you it kind was, of like a fading one. It on was it. good, but I would have liked more, like, just keep shooting lasers, you know? Yeah. Just keep stealing their turns in the in the frame advantage war, as they say. Oh, he's just two there. He's, he's starting to get a little bit better, but... It doesn't seem that he's prepared to how to use it correctly. Like, he's yeah. doing it, and then, like, he fishes for the reaction he's looking for, but then doesn't oh, react it. fast enough. I think he just might get I don't, it here. He should have refreshed. Yeah, I agree. That oh, was nice. very sick. So. I like that. I like that a lot. I was like, he's going to go for the down smash, and then she's going to ops attack it, right? Yeah. Because that's the standard, like, Falco, that covers every option, right? I, I wonder if down tilt was the best thing to do there. Like, off the dare, because then that's, like, one of three. It only covers tech place. It didn't cover tech away or tech in. So it was kind of No, no he covered there. tech away. I, really? It was long enough, yeah. Oh, okay. He just didn't. He covered three out of four options. Okay, okay. There's also a chance that like he could have fell off the platform to do the amendments of the... With like a slide off? Yeah. <laughs> that was pretty was fucking sick. Down? Is that a crouch he's, cancel? No, he, sli he got sli oh, slide, slide off, off the eye from the charge on smash and then shined him out of it. Great. That's pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. Oh man, these shield grabs. Oh jeez. Yeah, I, I just, he kind of, there's not a lot of adaptation I feel like still. It's more of just like, the game is being won by Elliot hitting harder than like the B. Yeah. It's not a lot of adaptation. It's just like, is he hitting his punish? Doing well, taking center stage here. Oh, wow. That was just weird. See, like right there, like a better player would probably have mixed up with like, instead of going for the immediate spot dodge, like maybe like shine, dare, shine, shine, dare, mm -hmm. double shine, grab. Shine grab. Right. He keeps going for the very standard, like, I'm going to roll or spot dodge options when things are kind of scary. Yeah. But it's good because he can abuse that because since he has such good tech skill, like, his out of shield game can mm -hmm. lead him turnover positions to get a full stock off of it. True. Just, up, just off of, like, one shine out of shield. Yeah. So he's willing to abuse, like, roll, spot dodge, shine, and shield because he can kill people off of it.
It's really starting to use down smash a lot too. Yeah. Down smash shouldn't really be that effective, honestly. Like it's the hitbox isn't like super great. It's not, but the thing is, is if they can't ops attack it and they're dying badly, then why not keep using it, right? Yeah. Oh, he tried to shine grab there for sure. Messed up his tech skill. Nice. I'm liking the punish game. Uh, messes up the laser. Nah. Oh wow, that get up attack barely hit Falco. Really bad there, coming down from the top platform there. Nice grab, I like that. Oh, he could have just full hop neared, I think. No, putting yourself right in position to get needled. Yikes. Up tilt, ooh, bear, okay, I respect it. Oh, Ali almost killed himself. Almost, almost again. Yeah. Uh, let's not look at that. Tilt, nice, so. now he's starting to use up tilt. I think he should always just spam up tilts on those platforms. Yeah, it's yeah. so good. Yeah. Like right there, that dare to up tilt would have been so good. Yeah, it crossed it up. It would have crossed up. Oh, nice. He's like he's going on stage. See, right here, he just needs to keep center stage. Like, yeah, he's like playing around with the platforms too much. Yeah. If you know the platforms are gonna mess up with your short hop and movement, like, why not just play center then? Mm -hmm. At that point. I agree. You're like, it's kind of like you're trying to force an exchange where you're like. Like in basketball, let's say you don't have, every time you get the ball passed to you, mm -hmm. no matter what look you have, you always go for the shot. Whereas oh, like, yeah. sometimes you can pass the ball back and reset back to neutral to find a better look. Right. And then once you get the ball passed, and then you're open, then you take the shot. Yeah. He's not willing to pass the ball back after. Yeah, that's an interesting way to look at it, I guess. Uh, Drug Fox t uh, told me that. Oh, really? Yeah. Nice read, but doesn't believe himself. I actually Set. like this pick a lot from uh, Tiffany Tumbles. It's it's decent. Yeah, he was really getting she was really getting spelled there too. He could have landed on the platform yeah. and continued the combo though. Oh, that's weird. He didn't throw out a dare there in the corner. That's not it yet. I like the choice though. Oh, nice trade. That was a good trade. Yeah. There's no move that would have killed uh, Elliot if he got hit from that position there. So yeah, it's good. Double laser, oh dude, that. Oh, that's a juicy combo right here. Like, he got 50% off of double lasers from Ledge. Yep. I guess that's why he's willing to play the key, continue playing the game. He just believes, like, if I hit my punish game, <laughs> I, won't, I don't have to go for more adaptations or mix ups. Yep. <laughs> Jab grab. Back in 2007 yeah. melee, are we? Yes. <laughs> See, right there, um, I would have went for another up tilt as well. See, here. Just up tilt. Go, yeah. Just I go walk away, it. laser, and back air and up tilt. Yeah. It's so good. Up tilt. <laughs> up tilt. Why not? Why is he? He's too jumpy. He's too jumpy. Yeah, he's yeah. just not short hopping. Like, he can just up tilt, and it's so good. Like, in places where he is down airing, I feel like he should just up tilt. Play a more grounded game. You also get the option to ASDI down, like when you're at lower percents. Oh yeah. That's true. When you're jumping, you don't even give yourself that option to option select the ASDI down, right? Yeah, that's what makes up feel so broken. Up like, tilt, hold down, yeah. and then if she dash taxi, you can shine her out of it. Yeah. Like, see, why is he trying to? He's trying to play like he's Fox. <laughs> like that's the way I look at it. You just got a whole ledge there. There's no mix up there actually. Might get a gimp here. He's oh. good. Yeah, it was gonna trade for sure. Oh. I'm surprised that worked. Yeah. Oh, why'd he roll? Just hold ledge and then ledge hop bear. Laser, laser, laser. No. You always gotta make sure to use a maximum amount of lasers when they're falling to stop as much momentum as they get. Mm -hmm. That they get, I mean. Because, like, if they get less momentum, they're gonna be way farther and, and easier edge guard. Right. So, like, why not full hop spam lasers? Yeah, that makes sense. Because you can't get punished out, anyways. Yeah. You're just basically giving them more space to get closer to you. It's like, that doesn't really sound that smart. He's, he's going ham right now, though, on that shield. You see what I mean? Like, why jump towards the corner nair against a, like, 15%? Cheek. Mm -hmm. It's like you could just spam up tilt and just like yeah. just hold that position. If you just you see how like Sheik was like on the right side of the platform and then Falco was on the left side of the platform. Yeah. Like 
just spam bears and up tilts there. Like she like right there, right? It's so good. And what's broken about Falco is that you can combo from up tilt. You can combo from bear. And they're defensive moves. And you get a lot of reward for it, so why not? Shine stall? That's something that I haven't seen Elliot do a lot. Shine stall. And that was right. catching. Avi was doing it and pretty much didn't get Edgar right. for it, so. Showing the difference of like Elliot's like mix up defensive mix up game compared to like Avi's. Oh nice, finally reads the Grab water. ledge, bear. Oh if one strong hit is probably gonna change this game. Oh my god, that shield poke. Oh, he yeah. actually double jumped so badly into those late uh, needles. Nice, that was not a good edge guard. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Alright, well. Elliot did his just first win. VSV. Elliot just won. Damn it, Kobe. Told you to come today. But he's uh, too busy. Elliot won. Oh, yeah, so. Just shout out uh, VSB. Worst timeline. <laughs> Long. I think we're gonna have a we're gonna have a big uh, VSB next Sunday. It's gonna be a uh, continuation of Cascade because Cascade was uh, originally supposed to be our regional. That was gonna be two day. Yeah. But uh, we're changing it to one day and then having a lot of the talent uh, come here on Sunday. So Richmond VSB. Uh, we're yeah. It's gonna be a big weekly next week. So make sure you try to come out to that. Yeah, and I think you guys will. Thoroughly enjoy it because Richmond as a whole is very, very fun. Yeah, it is. There's a lot of things to do here. A lot too. of good food. That's yeah. the number one thing. You got to make sure that your venue is near food. And yeah. this place kills it. Right. UBC is like you kind of have to walk pretty far to get good food. Yeah, that's true. It's so, just like the campus is like so big. Exactly, right? So I was going to say if you guys aren't thinking about going, you probably should go. I'm probably going to go. I booked a day off for work. Sunday or? Both days. Because oh, I nice, thought it was nice. going to be two days. Yeah, true. So I think you guys should come. Like, Richmond is awesome. I love Richmond. It's also, like, near the Canal Line. Very yeah. easy to transit here. Yeah. Very, very easy. And I have a theory. Like, ever since um, Tiffany Thomas switched uh, her tag to North Van, she immediately got three out. So, damn. That's true. Come on, Keegan. Why weren't you here today? <laughs> yeah. Shout out to Keegan, um, North Van Mel. Uh, all the people from SFU. Uh, hopefully they come out to uh, uh, BSB next week. So yeah, there you have it. Elliot's the champion. Couldn't defend uh, BSB. And they're switching it off to another game right now. Yep. Uh, do you know what's next? No idea. But uh, I guess we should just wrap out. Yeah. Uh, Tiffany had a pretty good uh, showing today. I don't know what I should call her. Like, is she going by B now? Or is she like going by B Tiffany and Tumbles? Tiffany's fine. I, I don't know. I think B and Tiffany Tumbles are both fine. I have like no idea. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna Good peace show. on out. By the way, that's not my Twitter. My Twitter now is Dorshi SSBM. Follow me, please. I do use it a lot. Oh shit! All right, all right. See you guys later. Peace out.